Let's learn some new vocabulary that you can use the next time you're at the bank. Here we go. Ellie. It's time to learn some common words related to banking and finance. Let's start with some basic words for money. Do you know what these are called? Bills. Are bills green or different colors in your country? And what are these? Coins. Your purse or pockets can get really heavy when you're carrying a lot of coins around. What is the word for the monetary system a country uses? Currency. Examples of currency are the Japanese yen and the British pound. Hmm, do you recognize this image? Check. Note that the ending is spelled with CK in the United States, but many other countries use QUE at the end. The pronunciation is the same. Check and check. These next two images represent very common payment methods. Which one is more commonly used when making an online purchase? Credit card. That's right. You can use a credit card to pay for a purchase at a later date. So which card do you need to access an ATM? Debit card. You can also use your debit card to pay for your purchase immediately. What is the shiny metallic square on most credit and debit cards called? Chip. Some machines use this chip to get your banking information. What's this machine called? It was mentioned in the sixth flashcard. Did you catch it? ATM. ATM stands for Automated Teller Machine, and it's able to do many banking functions for you. What is the name of this bank worker? Teller. If you want to interact with a person instead of using an ATM, you should talk to a teller. There are two really common actions you can do at a bank with an ATM or a teller. When you want to take money out of your account, what is this action called? Withdraw. Add AL to the end of the verb to make the noun withdrawal. And when you want to put money into your account, what's the name of this action? Deposit. The word deposit can be both a verb and a noun. Last one. What's this called? Signature. Sometimes you need to sign your name at the bank. Did you notice the verb sign in the noun signature? You've learned 12 new words to use the next time you're at the bank. Now it's time to practice and see how many words you can remember. Let's try a spelling activity first. Do you remember how to spell this word? Write it down on a piece of paper or say the letters out loud. Currency. Did you remember to use two R's? Moving on. Who's this person? Teller. Notice that there are two L's in this word. Try this last one. Do you remember what this is? Signature. Remember to think of the verb sign to help you with the spelling. Now let's try another activity. Which image is the check? That's right. Let's try another one. Which image shows a chip? Well done. Are you ready for the last one? Which image represents deposit? Yep, you got it. Good work. Now you know a lot of words that you can use the next time you're at the bank. For more practice, you can always watch this video again. Happy studying. Ellie.